This video is sponsored by Squarespace. Stick around to the end of the video to hear more. Languages are cool and you should learn them. Why? Well, a variety of reasons, social, cultural, economic, and biological, yes, that's right, biological, languages can help you live longer, but more on that later. Let's start with why I learn languages, because we all care about what I have to say. I learn languages because it's fun. It's fulfilling, it's a project. Just seeing yourself grow in a form of expression is... It's like learning an instrument, it's its own reward. Because at the end, you can play that instrument better. And for those of you who feel the same way, please don't let anything in this video distract you from that feeling. Intrinsic motivation is always going to be more effective than extrinsic. But for those of you who don't, that's fine, but I hope this video can encourage you to take another look at language learning and not write it off forever. There are a lot of people in this world, and you're never going to meet all of them, but if you ever leave your own country or region, you're likely to encounter people who do not speak your language. In fact, you're basically guaranteed to, even as an English speaker. Not everyone speaks English, and even when they do, it's important to consider the quality of communication. Being able to take an order of drinks in English is great, but you're never going to be able to properly talk to that person unless you learn their language, or they learn yours on a deeper level. And for some of the languages, and thereby some of the people in the world, why not be the one to put in the effort? Languages are a form of communication, but in reality they're more than that. They are deeply personal. If you live in a small town in a foreign country and you hear someone speaking your native language, that's an instant connection right there. Which is something that has happened to me and my family as Swedes and Britain. And this is by no means just with native speakers. The fact that I speak French, even though it's very clearly non-native, has let me connect with people from France, the Congo. It's a social thing. Look, all I'm saying is, how much cooler and more impressive would you be if you spoke more languages? A lot of people asked me this about my previous video. Why make English speakers learn languages they don't need? Why use taxpayer money for investing in foreign language education when it's just, economically, a waste? But that's not exactly true, is it? The fact of the matter is, language education is worth it. Lack of language knowledge has a massive impact on the economy, with some economists estimating that it costs the UK alone £48 billion a year, or 3.5% of its entire GDP. The point is that although English is pretty good for buying things, it's not so good for selling things to a foreign market. Now, if you're a massive multinational corporation, this is no problem. You can just hire Germans to run your company in Germany, Indonesians to run it in Indonesia, etc. But if you're a small to medium-sized company, you can't do that. So for those companies, language skills in their country of origin is essential. But in countries like the UK, it's lacking, and that hampers their exports severely, damaging the economy as a whole and funneling wealth towards those big companies who can afford to hire multinational staff. <laughs> Reading literature in translation isn't the same as reading the original. No one likes watching dubbed films. There is a serious wealth of art and history associated with every individual language and a culture you can invest yourself in with deeper linguistic study. You can survive in a lot of places with just English, and that's fine if surviving is your goal, but if you actually want to experience that place fully, properly engage with it, then you should learn its language. Learning languages can make you live longer. Studies have shown that knowing more than one language delays the onset of dementia by 4 to 4.5 years, regardless of other factors such as education status. In the context of these studies, that is undoubtedly a statistically significant difference. We really aren't sure why this happens, but it sure does seem to happen. Learning languages may be a lot of effort, but it's certainly worth it in the long run. But do you know what isn't a lot of effort? and is still worth it in the long run? This video sponsor, Squarespace. Squarespace gives you a powerful and beautiful online platform from which to create your very own website. Connect with your audience and generate revenue through gated members-only content. Manage your members, send email communications, and leverage audience insights all on one easy-to-use platform. This lets you create your online community with Squarespace's inbuilt system of threaded comments, likes, replies, and powerful blogging tools. Squarespace lets you display your social posts right on your website and automatically push website content to social media channels for optimal engagement. Go to squarespace.com for a free trial and when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash kcline to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. And I'll see you in the next video.